state election board has come under fire in court for the second time this week. The conservative and civil rights groups have asked a Fulton County judge to block some controversial rules adopted by the board just weeks before next month's election. Fox 5's Deidre Dukes is live at the Fulton County Courthouse with the latest. Deidre? Yeah, that hearing concluded just moments ago. The judge uh, listening to some three hours of testimony. He's being asked to determine whether the state election board had the authority to pass some controversial rule changes. Here, three members of the state election board, kind of like Napoleon, they put a crown on their head and say, we are the emperors of election. No, that is not the way that our system of government works. Attorneys for conservative and civil rights groups filed suit against the Republican-controlled state election board, alleging three board members overstepped their legal authority when they approved a rule allowing local election officials to delay certification of election results and made other rules changes leading up to the presidential election. The group argued the board violated state law. We're making decisions on what would make the election process more secure. State election board member Janelle King defended the board's actions ahead of Wednesday's hearing. The legal challenge, the latest in a slew of lawsuits filed by Republicans and Democrats, accusing King and two other conservative board members of ethics violations and overstepping their legal authority. On Tuesday, Superior Court Judge Robert McBurney blocked an election rule recently adopted by the board, which required the hand counting of ballots on election night. King said they may appeal that decision. I do feel like sometimes the victory does lie in the public knowing that the state election board is watching our process closely. You don't win them all, but you definitely put forth the effort to do what's best for the people. Now, as for today's lawsuit, the judge did not issue a ruling today. Uh, DeKalb County officials have also filed suit against the state election board, and that hearing is set for Friday. In Fulton County, Deidre Dukes, Fox 5 News. Deidre, thanks. Still add with